Hello, my name is Gabriela Imre and I'm working at the Life Cell Imaging Facility at Karolinska Institute in Sweden. In this short video, I will show you the easiest procedure for cleaning your cover slip before seeding your cells on it. Cover slips come in different shapes, round, square, rectangular, different sizes, but also with different thicknesses. Objectives are designed to be used with cover slips with a thickness of 170 micrometer and with the sample directly on the cover slip. Buy cover slips labeled as number 1.5. They have a thickness between 160 to 190 micrometer. So please pay attention so that you pick cover slips from a box having number 1.5 written on it. Using the wrong one, may have serious implications for your imaging. Before starting to seed your cells on the cover slip, it's recommended to clean them to remove any trace of impurities, increase cell addition and enhance coating. Make one molar hydrochloric acid solution in a glass container and put the cover slip in it and leave them in this solution for a couple of hours or overnight. This hydrochloric acid solution can be reused several times for several cleanings. So basically, after carefully decanting the acid, wash the cover slips extensively in distilled water. To sterilize the cover slip, prepare a 70% solution of ethanol and transfer the cover slip into this solution. After a couple of minutes in this solution, take them out and put them in a holder to dry. The cover slips are now ready to be used and the leftovers can be kept in a clean container. Many cells will grow happily on uncoated cover slips, but some do better with cover slips coated with, for example, polyalysin or collagen. The coating step should be performed after the cover slips are sterilized and dry. It's not always easy to pick up a cover slip from a well. A tool to help you with that is a needle of which you bend the tip a little bit with the help of your tweezer. Now you can access your well and easily fish out your cover slip and grab it with your tweezer. Thank you for your attention.